We'll get to <laughs> Shohei. The biggest series of the damn season right now is the Rangers and the Astros. But it's and the not, Rangers it got their ass series. kicked. It hasn't been a series. I know, but I want to hear his thoughts on it. He covers them. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I did. Uh, I, I have – uh, it's funny. I, I started covering the Rangers in 2016 and they went to the playoffs that year. And I was like, this is great. Baseball writing is going to be fun forever. And then I covered the Rangers for the next what six, seven years where they were just uh, not, not great at all. It was a whole lot of not fun. This year I moved to uh, newsletter coverage and they start winning again. And I'm like, dang it. I just, I left just at the wrong time. And now this month I'm feeling pretty good about my decision. Cause it is, it is not fun times in Arlington. The bullpen is uh, is just. I mean, they're the talent in the bullpen. I think is is better than what they've been performing, but the performance has been awful. Um, and I think the I think the biggest thing for me is that like the bullpen hasn't been good all year. It was never you know it would have its moments. There would be times when it would be streaky and be pretty good. But it was covered up early in the year because the Rangers were scoring seven, eight, nine, ten runs a night. I mean, the offense was just going nuts every night. Now the offense is cold, um, and when the team's scoring two, three, four runs a night, that bullpen's not good enough to keep those leads, and it's it's bad times. Like, I don't – if the Rangers are going to go to the playoffs, which they're currently a half game out of uh, playoff position right now, it's going to have to be because their, their offense wakes back up. I don't think they have the bullpen to do it. The rotation's pretty good. Evaldi wasn't great last night in his first start back, but he's a better pitch than what we saw last night. Max Scherzer is Max Scherzer, even though he's not, you know, the max of eight, nine years ago. Um, Jordan Montgomery has been very good. John Gray has been very underrated, I think, but he just doesn't get any run support. But I think the success of this team is going to be if their offense can come back and start scoring those six, seven, eight, nine runs a night. Well, let, let me, let me ask you this real quick and simple. Are they, are they going to make the playoffs in your mind? That I don't think the Mariners right are there. as good as they <laughs> are as good as they've played. Uh, the Blue Jays are inconsistent. It's going to be close. It's it comes down to I think only one of the Mariners, Blue Jays, and Rangers is going to make the playoffs. So if one of those teams gets hot, they're in. Um, but I think only one of those three get in, and I think either one has the ability to do it. Any one two of the of three have three. the have the horses. Is, do you think it'll be two of the three? three? Yeah, it has to be. Does that, unless, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless, yeah, Todd, because, unless Todd's Yankees go on a run that he's calling for. Or Jared Kyle is his Red no, Sox. No, no, no. Right, 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 right. Listen, listen. They got to play Seattle seven times before the season's over with. 